playing on the beat They did send me whatever it is in this box. I think it's clippings, and it is a perfect time for me to try some because I have my natural hair out. So let's see what the clippings look like before we even get into so, them. As you can see, this is the packaging, okay? And they come just like this with some care instructions and um, a few goodies to get the party going. Our PU Clipping Hair 24 Natural Yaki. And I think this will match my hair texture perfect. Let's take them out the box, the out the bag. But I can't say this is some long clippings. So let's look at. It. So here are the clippings right here. I've been seeing these type of clippings all over Instagram. They're supposed to be seamless, easy to install, and the texture of this is perfect. Um, I only did receive one pack. So hopefully this is enough for the thickness of my natural hair. So what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go into my workroom, refresh my hair, and then we're gonna go ahead and install those clippings to see how we like it. Okay, so my press is about a week old. Um, Let me see if I can adjust this and scoot this back. Okay, so it's about a week old. I washed it. I usually press my hair like maybe um, twice a year. I did cut like a good four inches off of my hair, but yeah, that was just because it was just getting a little bit too long for me. Oh my God. <laughs> so, this is what she looks like. Like I said, about a week old. Um, I, water has hit my hair. Um, but I am gonna comb it out. We're gonna do a length check and then we're gonna add the clip-ins and see how well they blend.
Okay, so I went through and flat ironed my hair. I did flat iron my hair on like 340. I didn't want to put too, too much heat on it. It's fairly straight, okay? It is heavy right now because like I said, it is um, a week old, okay? So the it's not as flowy as it was when I first did this. But for the sake of this video, we are going to proceed. And I'm gonna give you what you need. All right, ooh, the back is kind of puffy. Let me go through it one more time. I'm gonna go give myself a little uh, protein treatment from Afro G so my curls can snap back because this is a, a little bit much heat for me. I am not a person that have their natural hair out like that, so it's like, mm, girl, what are you doing? This is the hair. I'm about to stand up, show you guys, or scoop back and show you guys the length. Again, I cut off at least four inches when I uh, initially straightened it. Which I think. It's still pretty good, right? This is from where nothing but wigs. I have the clip-ins and I must say, the color's off a tad bit, but not anything alarming, okay? But they look good. Look at that. It looks good. My hair is a little, the clippings are or on the browner side and my hair is like off black. So, one long piece for the back. Then it looks like two of the same pieces for the sides, right? But still for the back. And then you have three little, uh, little pieces. And then you have two pieces for your front. So we're gonna put all of them in, okay? So we're gonna start with the long piece for the, from, from the back. Sit those over there. So I'm gonna just take it and measure it to like, so it's like that. So I know I'm gonna part it from here to here. Parts doesn't have to be perfect because they are underneath. So what I like about these clip-ins is that they give, they're giving tape-ins. Like it's so flat that when you put your hair down or if somebody was to touch the back of your head, they will not feel these. Like, you know, your traditional clip-ins, they're kind of bulky, but these are so not that. And I appreciate that. Like, I really do because, oh, and they don't hurt. For me, clip-ins are uncomfortable, but these right here were not uncomfortable at all. And it only took me about five minutes to install these. Okay, so I have three clip-ins in all together. So two rows worth of clip-ins. Now I have three of the short wefts or the small wefts. So I'm gonna part my hair again, a little higher up for a little bit more coverage. And we're gonna install these three. Okay, 
Okay, so I thought I was gonna need two bundles or two packs, but actually, no, I do not. And I kind of like how it's already like a gradient, like my natural hair is going into this. But I think I am still gonna add the two small ones right here in the front just to fill it out for the sake of the video. A little shorty, just like the extra small. And then we just gonna clip it right here. Well, not too on the edge. Right, and then we're gonna flip her back on down. Okay, so now all the pieces are in. I'm just gonna go through the hair and lightly flat iron just to help bend, blend everything in. Okay, you guys, so I put all the tip clippings in and I absolutely love these. Like, I love these. This blends so well with my natural hair. It's crazy. So I definitely gonna, I want to go back in and wash my hair to reinstall these clippings. So if you wanna see that and how it looks freshly out, make sure you are subscribed and turn your notifications on so you guys can see the new video. But other than that, everything that I use will be down below in the description box. And until next time, bye best friends.